Hi, this is David with Republic Manufacturing. Today I wanted to show you guys how we install the belt on the RB500. We get a lot of calls about the belt being too small on the blower. However, it's not. The belt is what we call a self-tensioning belt, which is why the tension is so tight. And as the blower runs, it actually loosens up to the right tension. So with the RB500 and the belt guard off of it, the first thing we always have to do is check our alignment. That's one of the number one reasons for belt breakage or belts flying off or things of that nature. So we take a straight edge and we align it to the bottom motor pulley and lay it flat up against the blower pulley. And we should be right at the end groove of the blower pulley. Once we've confirmed that our alignment is correct, the next thing we have, and that will help us out quite a bit, will be our Republic belt installation tool. This is a great tool to save you a lot of time, a lot of effort as far as putting this belt on. However, we do have customers that like to just roll the belt on by hand and that's okay too. The next thing we need is of course our belt. So we take the belt, we put it on the top pulley. Once the belt's installed on the top pulley, we add it to the bottom pulley. We roll the bottom pulley till it's just a little tension on it, as much as we can by hand. Then we use our belt installation tool to put into the two grooves here and we're gonna use this to roll the belt onto the pulley. As we turn it, it automatically aligns the belt into the motor pulley. And you'll notice that we have the belt misaligned on the blower pulley, which is not a big deal, that's normal. So what we would do is we actually take our hands and we're gonna push the belt back onto the pulley as we roll it. And then the bottom pulley is misaligned, so we'll do the same thing. And we have our belt on and installed. And again, once this belt runs a few minutes, you'll see it self-corrects for the right tension on the belt. So now to remove the belt, you're actually gonna take your fingers, you're gonna pull on the belt and to pull it forward to pull it off the pulley. Then you can go either bottom pulley or top pulley. I prefer to start at the top. And as I pull it, you can see the belt rolling off. And there we go, it slides right off. Just as a recap, to install the belt, we actually use the straight edge to make sure we check the alignment. Put the belt on the blower pulley, take the belt and put it on the motor pulley and hand tighten it to where we can't turn it anymore. Once we have it to that point, we're gonna use the Republic belt installation tool to actually roll the belt onto the pulley. Once we have it rolled onto the pulley, it may misalign on the top pulley again. So what we're gonna do is just use our hands and walk it on back and forth by pushing the belt onto the pulley. Then once it's time for removal, we're gonna do just the opposite. We're actually gonna pull it off the blower pulley itself and we're gonna walk it back and forth till it completely comes off. If you have any questions, contact us here at Republic or you can also check our website. You can find instructions there. Thank you.